Libertarians just want to take care of themselves and not take care of other people. You must hate the poor, you must love the rich. You must be a pacifist. They are different from what you are. I want everybody to die from tainted liquor or from food poisoning. For reason, I'm Justin Monticello. I'm here in New Hampshire for Porkfest, or the Porcupine Freedom Festival, put on by the Free State Project. It's an annual week-long gathering of liberty-minded individuals, from anarchists to libertarians. I'm here to ask folks, what's one thing you're tired of hearing when you tell other people your political beliefs? Sometimes people will say like, things like, oh, anarchists are all violent. Without government, warlords will take over society. It bothers me because with government, warlords have already taken over society. My mom, uh, she pretty much just asks, why? Why are you a libertarian? No, we're supposed to be Democrats. They're like, normally black people aren't libertarians, but I'm like, nah, some people are just way different than others. Being a Democrat, it's kind of a trap, you know, they tell you one thing and they do something else. I really dislike when people say, well, Venezuela didn't fail because it wasn't real socialism. You know, marijuana is evil. How will people build public roads without government? The taxes that you pay as a business are the price that you pay to be a part of a civilized society. I grew up in the north of Mexico. My parents are cattle ranchers and no one maintained the road, no government did. The local ranchers got together and decided to pool their funds to hire a tractor to go pave the road. So who will build the roads? Well, I've already answered that question in my own lifetime. Definitely, I'm transitioning into a crypto-based company. I'm really tired of hearing all of people's fear excuses. Government has effectively banned cryptocurrencies in India, so like, the thing that I'm tired of hearing, it's maybe a plot of the dark web, and since it's anonymous, it can be used for like bad things. People that say that the bailouts that we did, you know, that these banks were too big to fail, the rich don't pay for this stuff, you know, it's, it's regular people. You know, the people that can basically least afford it. I shouldn't object to paying $26,000 a year in tax to run a small restaurant so that I can have employees that can barely read. And what I'm most tired of hearing is that I don't care about the environment, charity, just because I don't want government doing anything about it. Small changes in the amount of decentralization or centralization changes how happy our society is, how healthy our children are, how long we live, that sort of thing. I actually care more than the person who's not willing to question how they go about accomplishing those goals. I would say I'm maybe tired of a lack of openness. You know, what are your philosophies rather than your labels? I know the only thing that the universe really cares about is how we treat each other. Using coercive government, just it's time to move beyond that. There's much less harmful, much more efficient ways of doing that. I mean, I like being free. 